Grand Bahama Island will soon get a new hospital. The long-awaited medical center is a necessity after the island's hospital was badly damaged by Hurricane Dorian in 2019. Our Going Caribbean News, Deandra Hamilton reports. Grand Bahama in the Bahamas will finally be getting a new hospital. This from the country's Prime Minister, Philip Davis. We have, you heard them. We have, all, yes. Amen. We have also provided funding mm -hmm. to capitalize the Grand Bahama Health Center Development Company. Wow. This entity, this entity will construct the new Grand Bahama Hospital. Yeah. Davis made the announcement during his national budget communication in the House of Assembly last week. The construction is a major initiative for Grand Bahama. In 2019, the island's hospital, the Rand Memorial, was severely damaged by Hurricane Dorian. Since then, residents and workers have been calling for something new. The island was also supported with a tent hospital by the Samaritan's Purse after Hurricane Dorian, but that too was impacted by extreme weather. Prime Minister Davis noted that the construction of the new hospital will be facilitated by a loan, which he said is being finalized. This is being facilitated through a loan for $150 million, which is now being finalized. Davis also announced that the government would be allocating $10 million to catastrophic health care in the new budget. He said it would provide meaningful assistance to Bahamians suffering from non-communicable diseases. Madam Speaker, I'm extremely pleased to be able to announce that we have allocated $10 million for catastrophic health care in this budget. This, this means that, Madam Speaker, for the first time, the government can provide meaningful assistance, meaningful assistance to long-term dialysis patients, heart patients. DeAndre Hamilton reporting.